Hey everybody, Ray here. Welcome to It's All About the Cocktail. I know you don't believe there could be another celebrity endorsed whiskey or bourbon. I want to introduce to you Wolf Moon. It was formed when Jason Aldean and Flora George Line were on tour together. So I'm going to show you a few different ways that I, that I tried it. I'll tell you a little bit more about Wolf Moon, so stick with me. I'll see you in a bit. Okay, so one of the ways I decided to try it was a neat by itself, okay? I poured a little bit of water in here. I like to put a little bit of water into my whiskeys and bourbons, open them up. Now I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna waste your time with, I smell, no, I smell leather. I, I smell, you, I mean, you really don't wanna, you really don't care what the hell I think, what I smell anyway, so. Just taste it, right? Good, I mean, a lot of bourbon purists are looking for something a little bit, a little bit stronger. This is something that they kind of made for when they're when they're done with their their tours and like to share a bottle between them. So it's actually a pretty good marketing marketing ploy by Florida George Line and Jason Aldean. They actually you know put the banner up and did some did some a lot of promotions while they're on tour. I mean, all those faces, all those people that got to know this product because they put it up there and they were all wearing T-shirts of it. Good good marketing on their on their part. But let's see if we can not figure out one more way to. Try this and I'll tell you more about this. Now it has been said that the year's first full moon sometimes is called the wolf moon. Tradition has it that in January when the food supplies are kind of depleting, how the wolves howl and they kind of point up at the moon. They kind of point up on the moon like this little guy in the bottle here because they actually do that because they're, they're announcing them themselves. They're saying they're here. This is my territory. This is my crib. So on the mash bill, on the mash bill, we got like two thirds corn, one third like a rye and barley mix. You can definitely taste the rye in there. Where it come, where they get that, all those grains in the rye from, they don't really say, but they, they, they say Midwestern rye. My, my guess is MGP, which MGP supplies grain for a lot of different, a lot of different bourbons and whiskeys. Check this out. Angel's Envy, Bullet Rye, George Dick Rye, Rebel Yell Rye. There's a bunch of all different names I didn't even write down. Whistle Pig Old World Rye, Willet Rye, and my, one of my wife's favorites, Templeton Rye. So that's a pretty impressive uh, resume there. So in a in a in an old fashioned quickly, I like it. Hey, you know, as I added, the editing process seems to take me too long. I know I, I want to kick out videos sooner and more of them, but the editing process just takes me so long. But my friend and neighbor, Carla, had another way that she tried it. So I'm going to let her end it by showing you the way she tried it. So if you do like this, you find this even remotely interesting, smash that like button. Hit subscribe. I'm on my way to a thousand subscribers. And send me a comment. Let me know. Do you like do you like Wolf Moon? Do you like bourbon? Do you like alcohol? Do you like my videos? What do you just send me a comment, man? Tell me what you think, okay? I'll catch up to you. See you later, my friends. So my before dinner um, cocktail, I did a Kentucky mule with the um, I don't know if you can see that, but the Wolf Moon bourbon. Obviously, I've been drinking quite a bit of it over the last week or two. I need a couple of Kentucky meals. I love the snow, Ray. I love the snow. I love the snow, Ray. I like making snow angels. <laughs>